So, uh... There's a few things I want to mention before we start recording. Or, like, we start this episode as, a. Uh, well, um, I might be a little bit distracted in this first level, as, uh, well, <laughs> something I didn't notice last recording, because it was, like, 4am when I was recording it. Uh, yeah, um, the level before... The C is level 2. Yes, I don't get hit with Rizro of all things. So, uh, yeah. Uh, if you don't mind a little uh, pre ramble, that's fine. Um, first thing. Yeah, like, the first thing I wanted to mention is like. I'm thinking of when I'm grinding for items. Uh, that. Perhaps I will, um, sometimes, like, have to, um, like, I don't want to, but, like, maybe, um, use an item when I can, um, so, like, for this instance, if we had a water bomb, I would use a water bomb and, um, a harp, because, uh, from what I've noticed, um, this map doesn't tend to spawn in items if you already have, like, one or two. Um, I was debating about this because, uh, <laughs> that second hookshot I have, um, I wasn't expecting to get it, but, um, redoing, um, fucking Volga's no-hit level, um, I was able to get another one of those because it just happened, oh, sorry, happened to spawn there. Uh, in fact, if I wanted to do it again, um, I could get another hookshot if you can see that. Um, just throwing this out there, but it's going to have to see how I feel about that and like how you guys feel about that, like, because it definitely makes my job a whole lot easier, especially on this map, because, uh, <laughs> oh boy, this has, like, already, uh, this map has not been fun to plan around because, uh, just the plans end up falling to shit almost immediately, um, case in point, uh, this level. Um, I'm thinking that I'll give this three tries, and, uh, if it doesn't go so hot, then we'll start the detail off to uh, the Rizzo's level 2 weapon as it's not that far, um, if everything goes to plan, it's like two episodes away, and then we can return to this, but like, I really want to see his level 2 weapon. <laughs> because I really like Seal as a character. Um, but yeah, uh, second thing I'll, well technically third thing now, uh, that I'll mention as we're getting into this is that, uh, <laughs> Hopefully, if everything works out right, uh, things might look a little bit different. Um, uh, I, I guess. Um, Bizro was my like was the character I used, used for grinding a lot uh, in between maps. I'm thinking I might continue that up a little bit, maybe. Um, yeah, if uh, everything goes to plan, uh, everything, uh, things should look a little bit better, because, uh, <laughs> after, I don't know how long, um, kind of realised that I should probably check my settings in, um, the, uh, program I'm using to record this, um, 
funnily enough, I noticed that I should pro like I thought of checking them like uh, when I was explaining like I guess yeah explaining to um a dude on Reddit that uh how resolution works and it was like oh uh. If OBS has these settings, then maybe my thing should have these of those too. Um, so I'm thinking, although it may not go down so well. Um, oh fucking hell, cocos. Uh, <laughs> that I'll split these runs up into two. Um, one where I'm more focused on um getting the A rank, and one where I focus on finding the harpies. Um, although if we do happen to stumble across the harpies along the way, then, you know, that's something. Um, also something I did notice that while I was editing the last episode, um, is that the don't get hit with Volga um, didn't grade us on time, oddly enough. So I'm thinking that maybe uh, the game might be throwing us a bone by saying, "Hey, uh, you might need to be extremely cautious about this shit." So, uh. We're not going to grade you on time. Okay. Just trying to, uh... Not get hit here. It's, uh... <laughs> already doing wonders for my stress. Um... Hmm? But, like, yeah, um, <laughs> also doesn't really help that, uh, yesterday I finally got around to going to the pool and doing a few laps, and, um, <laughs> while my fucking forgetting basic anatomy, like, I guess my upper arms? Yeah, upper arms, I think, um, have kind of stopped screaming now. Uh, it's just like, oh, uh, because I felt like just playing a shit ton of Splatoon um, today and last night. Uh, <laughs> my um, hands are screaming too. Um, although specifically just my um, right thumb joint. I guess you could say that is. Um, but that's just down to the fact that um, I'm an Octobrush user and um, recently discovered the magic of um, run speed. And uh, <laughs> oh boy, it is amazing. So what? Uh, Basically today, um, I've had most of my hair, like, most of my arms screaming at me. Um. The only part that hasn't been screaming is, uh, my forearms. <laughs> Although, <laughs> I think any more stress and, uh, my right forearm might start screaming? Uh, I guess, I get the feeling that my left is, uh, used to, to that. <laughs> If you catch my drift. But yeah, um... I, I get the feeling everything's falling to sh- oh, is eventually gonna fall to shit. Looks like things are going over way too well. <laughs> Although I guess it, it's kinda like I'm using a um character in a fucking- oh, like, I've been controlling an enemy in a fucking bullet hell ga game, so it's like, yeah, I suppose that works. Um, hmm. But yeah, at the time of recording this, um, is it the hobbies? K 
Okay, nice. Not going for that, but you know, whatever. Um, <laughs> yeah. At the time of recording this, um, nice. I edited shit. Um, yeah, I edited shit. Um, I edited the finale of Roman Origins and just. Uh, oh boy. Um, hmm. And thankfully, the game I'm planning on doing next doesn't really take that much practice. Like, I can go in somewhat blindly and be fine with it. Um, it just has to um, quickly test it out just to see um, how the controls felt because um, I'm used to, to playing it or playing the original version and I was just wondering if um, the I guess enhanced port um, made things a little bit different. Um, it was surprisingly fine, although, <laughs> uh, the type of game it was, um, it felt really weird. I really should have saved the fucking thingy thing. Um, can I have a fucking time clock thingy, please? Please? Oh yeah, right, fucking I can't use that. <laughs> uh, I need to the focus. Most likely going to be a bad idea. Um, I was gonna say I should probably check, but I don't want to throw off my groove that I'm in at the moment. Um, okay. wow, that did nothing. Um, I'm just wondering who the final boss is. Okay, it's definitely- okay, thank you, random stranger. Um... <laughs> okay, so it's just down to Sheik and, um, Darunia. I'm hoping I don't need to face Sheik. Because, uh, Sheik could be fucking hell to fight. I'm probably going to object to myself if I say this, but like, I didn't have that bad a time facing Rizro. Oh, Ruto last time. Um. 110% going to need to frame by frame that shit. Uh... What? I really need to keep my fucking distance from this shit. I mean... I just really want to know how much damage I can take to pass. Because, uh... I don't know how many enemies I can kill... Before I get my, so oh, get my force attack. Okay, that makes things a little bit easier. I mean, I would just like stroll the fuck up in into there and just like unleash the C3, but like. Uh, 
Okay, I suppose that makes sense. Okay. Uh, I mean... We did get the fucking heart piece. Uh, yeah, actually, even though I did not get a, like I took damage, I'm thinking that I might just continue on to see um, how much a like what the a rank damage is. Although I get the feeling it's going to be um, four thousand and not ten thousand. Um, but I mean, I guess it'll be a cool thing to check. Not so much in doing it this way, I can see who the um, end boss is. I mean... Okay... So Sheik, so we can have it on the base. Okay, um, I'm gonna have to do this fast because I'm this. Oh boy, I get the feeling that Chica's gonna fucking kill shit. Um, hmm. I mean, I will, I mean, it has been a while since I've used, well, oh, Wizroy. Okay, there we go. Um. Well, I mean, even if it was a 10,000, I'm shit out of luck. It's probably not going to be the best way to go about this. I'll say thanks to Rooney, my dude. Um, but I'm thinking that... I think regardless if we get a B rank... Um, I'll just move on to um, see his level 2 weapon level and hope that's okay. Um. <laughs> because, um. I kind of get the feeling that if I dwell on this level 2 long, then, um. I'll just spend, I don't know how long, just on it, trying to attempt it. Um, so not to mention this level seems oddly familiar. Um, could be wrong, but I'm thinking that in the 3DS version they gave this level to um, Princess Zelda. And uh, with her um, fucking Dominion Rod. Specifically, I'm thinking. <sighs> yes, also, uh. Doing it this way, um. I can see. what we're graded on. So, um. That way, if it has to come to it, then I can take the, uh. A ring attempt much slower. I'm thinking. Huh? Okay. Not the result I wanted, but... Considering what type of level that was... 
I'll take it. Um, so I'm thinking that I'll do this episode a little bit differently. Um, I'll do... Yeah. Um, I'll see what C is level 2 wep weapon levels like. Um, hopefully we have the materials to get it. Because, uh... <laughs> Yeah, that's... Wait. I need to look back on the previous episode because I'm... Um... Was it Chaos? Huh. I, I definitely need to double check that because, like, I got the feeling that the one we did with Volga, it was like the opposite. Time didn't matter. It was fucking damage. Okay, it is. A level five? Sure? Um... Hmm... Mm. Well, I'll do this one. Um... Depend- uh, yeah, I, I suppose, um... Depending on how long this episode is, or ends up being, because I get the feeling that this level could be a while. Um, I'll just make next episode the um, back, or supposed back end to this, especially if this one's going to be long. Um, hmm. Love the feeling of um my uh, duvet getting in the way of my fingers. Okay. Um. Hmm. So this one could be interesting. Um. Hmm. So I don't think the game has ever explained what the um level numbers mean, um, but basically they're just the, uh, difficulty rating, I suppose. So, taking the, um, base defense level that we did, episode 61, as an example, um, since that was a level 9, that was one of the hardest of its kind, so, um, Anything lower than that, then we won't have that many um, enemies to deal with. I'm, I'm thinking. I'm, I'm thinking that's how that one works because um, sometimes you just have to fight like less than nine pros, essentially. Damn, he's running fucking what? Um, although the, the, I just really hate this type of level, just down to the fact that, um, it's kind of hard to deal with. Like, the more bases you take over, the more, well, yeah, the larger your thing grows, or your team grows. Therefore making it so that, uh, the more thing, or the more traitors appear. And, uh, because this is a level 5, I'm going to assume that, like, 5 leaders are here. 
and wanting to fuck me up. Essentially. Which makes things a little bit difficult, considering the type of map we're in. So I should really be using C C3. I think it is. Or maybe it's C2. But oh, the, the game's beginning to chug. <laughs> uh. Although I kind of, like, I, I really want to know if it's just my Wii U specifically, since it is like really fucking old. I think. Uh? Sure? Game? Yeah, I can kind of see why things are kind of turning to shit over here. Um, yeah, also I get the feeling that speed's going to be an issue with all for this. Although that being said, I could just maybe just go to the bases. Just take them over and like not worry about them. Fucking cloud, yeah, crowd control. But yeah. I'm thinking that this is like the best way to deal with it. Especially with how pinned in everyone is. Oh, I am at the moment. Just... Yeah, like I want to say I've had this Wii for like oh, since eight, oh, yeah, since 2012. If not like early 2013. So, like, yeah, um, hmm. It is beginning to well, slow down. <laughs> Although, that being said, I'm kind of surprised how well it's been able to hold up. Although, that being said, I would really prefer to get some, like, replacement cables. If that's possible. Okay. This should lower my morale. Them. Hopefully. Hmm. But I'm just really kind of glad that um <laughs> thing works the way it does. Like. Uh, okay, nice impel with a fucking crescent, <laughs> fucking Sailor Moon over here. I'm just kinda glad. Uh, it, that's definitely going to make going for the A rank a lot easier. Okay, yeah, it is the C. It would enhance C2 that she uh, uh, wants to step on you. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> So I'm not sure, like, what it is about this year, but like, I, I don't know why, but like, this year specific, like, recently, um, kind of discovered I have a thing for, um, a certain type of, uh, look. <laughs> That is definitely an angle. There's... Where are they fucking getting all the morale from? I think, yeah, Sundari would be the look. Like, I'm definitely not into that, but eh. <laughs> you know, if it's here, I might make some some oh, might make some eh, exceptions. Okay. Uh, oh, eh. 
Is it the soldiers that r raise the morale? Like what? Seriously, where are you guys finding the morale? Dude, fucking Rudo's gonna have some fucking shit. Mm. Although, upside of all this shit is that uh, Kehos is not gonna be a problem. <laughs> Time one. 100% is. And like the worst thing about all of this um, is that her obviously is level 3 is ways away. Um, like I get the feeling that just fucking getting over to that is going to be an issue. Um, dude, where, where are you fuckers coming from? Like, it, it definitely seems that I need to do some research on this level. Like, it's especially the whole thing of like, how the enemy team gains morale. That could be like a big part. How long is, have we been doing this? Oh, pff, nine! Uh, I'm, I'm thinking we, we just go. Hopefully, we'll be able to do things. Level 5 of this level is fucking difficult as shit. Because, uh, like, although I get the feeling that my big mistake was just staying around doing crowd control and not rushing off. Because, uh,. Okay. Actually, yeah, I kind of get the feeling that um, maybe the easy to finish, but I just fucking can't. Okay, fuck it, I, I, I think I know where her heart piece is. Things, that, things are falling to shit. We can finish this. And hopefully get a no ring still. Just need to go back for the hard base. <sighs> Zelda, buddy, why? Why you do this to me? Where the fuck are you?
Um, um, I, I apologize if I go quiet here, it's just like... Victory and... Oh, both victory and defeat are just in my grasp right the fuck now. I just need to, uh... Fucking kill this bitch. Fuck you, Central Hall. I don't need you. gonna say if uh, <laughs> that fell to shit completely it's <laughs> gonna say uh, at least I know or like now I know what cock, ha cock holding feels like <laughs> oh. I'll, I'll, I'll take the fucking stick I'll, I'll take the pleasure rod. <laughs> I, I don't. I don't care. Uh, see, you don't need all these weapons, honey. You don't. Uh, I do keep that one. That'll make getting the fucking harpies <laughs> just that much easier. <laughs> Here I was thinking that the fucking don't get hit level was going to be the worst level we did today. Nope. <sighs> oh boy, just, uh, just a punch to the face and then like, oh. A punch to the face and then a fucking punch to the dick straight after that. <sighs> fucking hell. Or should I say cocking hell? <laughs> 